Okay, today you're gonna need a piece of white paper. It can be just computer paper. This is just learning to draw lines and practicing. And some crayons, any colors that you wanna use, any type of crayons. So the first line we are going to draw, and they can go anywhere on your paper. You don't have to exactly follow me. We're gonna draw a vertical line. Now that goes straight down from the top of the page to the bottom of the page. Next up, I'm gonna draw a horizontal line. That goes from one side to the other. Try and make it as straight as you can. All right, next up, I am gonna draw a diagonal line. And that is gonna go from corner to corner. Or from, from high to low. All right, so those are your three basics. Now, we are going to learn how to draw a bumpy line. Now, a bumpy line is like drawing a lowercase m. You have one hump and it comes down, and then the next hump and it comes down. It's kind of a point. And then you just keep drawing that m all attached over and over. And that's our bumpy line. Think of little hills all next to each other. That's your bumpy line. All right, next line I'm gonna draw a zigzag line. Now zigzag is like drawing the letter V, okay? And then you just keep drawing letter Vs all attached to each other. Make sure they're nice and pointy, not rounded like the bumpy line. They're pointed. So it's just like drawing a line of Vs that connect. All right, my next type of line that I want to draw is a wavy line. Now a wavy line, think of a lowercase n, okay? It's a hump, but instead of being pointed like the bumpy line, it's gonna curve out and there's gonna be a U that it's attached to. So N, U, kind of like that, and it's more rounded. And that's how you draw a wavy line. Okay, next two are pretty easy. Okay, so a dotted line, it's a line of dots. Don't pound your crayon. Draw a dot, space, dot, space. All the way your paper. Dot space, dot space. Dot space, dot space. See how I'm like coloring in those dots? I'm not pounding my crayon into the paper. Okay. All right, next type of line. Dashed line. It's very similar to the dotted line, but we're using a line and then we leave a space. Line, space, line, space, line, space, line, space, line, space, line, space, line. Okay, dashed, dotted. Okay, they've got spaces in those lines. All right. Next type of line we're gonna do is a curved line. Super easy, okay? Kinda like the letter C. Okay, if we put it on its side or any other way, just a curve. All right, here is a difficult one. So you gotta really watch me here. This is the loop to loop line, all right? So it's gonna start out going straight. Think of it as a roller coaster that flips. It's gonna go up, 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 and it's gonna curve back 
back down and it's gonna cross that line and make a loop. All right, and up, 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 cross. Up, and it's gonna come back down and cross the line. Up, 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 up cross. Up, 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 cross. Up, down, cross. Up, down, cross. Up, down, cross. All right, so that's our loop-de-loop -loop line. All right, next type of line. Now, if you run out of space on this side, you can always flip it over. All right, here is another fun one. This is a swirl, also a little difficult. Okay, so what I like to do is I like to put a little dot. That's gonna be the center of the swirl. Now, I am gonna go straight out from that swirl. Now I wanna run, or straight out from that dot, and I'm gonna start running around that dot. I'm gonna go all the way around. I'm gonna get a little bit bigger as I go, because you want some distance here. And I'm gonna get a little bit bigger each time I go around and around. And there is your swirl. Okay, I'll show it one more time, different color. Okay, dot. This one you might wanna practice. Make sure these lines don't cross each other, okay? They should be apart. So you got your dot. You're gonna drive your line straight out from the dot. Now it is going to drive around that dot in a circle, but it's gonna get a little bit bigger before you get to the end. Okay, we're gonna go around again and we're gonna get a little bit bigger. And around, and around. And that is your swirl. All right. Next type of line. This is another hard one, but I know you guys can do it. It's called the castle wall. Okay. We are gonna go straight out. Okay, it's just a little horizontal line. Now we're gonna go up a vertical line. Okay, it's like a backwards L. Now we're gonna go over another horizontal line and down, and we want it to like line up with this part. It's almost like we're drawing a square, but we're not gonna go back this way. We're gonna go away from that square. Okay, up, over, down. Okay, and we're not going that way. We're going this way to continue it. So you go over, up, over, down. Okay. And it's like a castle, the, those little gaps in a castle wall. Okay, over, up, over, down. And there is all of our types of lines that we are going to learn about today.